It's a lot of lust, not a lot of love. Hey, I stack it up, can't get enough. What's good, you guys? That by Ronaldo7 here. Welcome back to my channel. And today we're gonna do a brand new video today. And um, as you guys already know, it's been a long time since I haven't uploaded. It's good to be back. So um, I like to do a today. I'm gonna do a collection video. And uh, as you guys already know, this is this this is my second collection video. Because in the past I made a long ass time ago I made uh, what's called a jersey collection video. But this time I'll make another collection, but it's gonna be sneakers, like what sneakers I rock to school or sneakers that I just rock to go to like the stores or so. But before we get started, I just want you guys to like, subscribe my channel, and follow my social medias will be which will be down in the description. So let's get started. All right, as you guys already know, I have a bunch of sneakers right here, so I'm gonna bring some boxes. It's gonna take a long time. All right, you guys, so I have all the shoes right here. Let me take a little 360, get a bunch of boxes here. But you'll you'll look at you look at them more when we start reviewing them. So our box number one, which is shoe number one. I have actually um, four boxes. Some are in the boxes. So I've got an, an Adidas, an Adidas box right here. First of all, uh, I like the box of it. It's a nice classic Adidas box. So enough about that. We're gonna get into the shoes. We got the uh, shit, the Adidas NMD R1, and they are um, like I guess an older model. You guys could call it like. Um, I like this shoe because it's pretty comfortable. It's like a, a pretty good shoe to like for running and, and just for comfortability. This is a pretty comfortable shoe, um, and it's the it's got like the boost, it's like the boost right there, and it is pretty comfortable. And and what I like about uh, what I like about more about this M, about NMDs is when when I have like the the strap the straps. I have like the Japanese words right there. It looks pretty cool with that, and then the uh, the classic, the idea of this classic logo right there. And it been, what's, what's good about, what's good about this shoe um, is the details about this, just like the lines and all this uh, color. It's pretty cool. It's got like that pink and and grayish colorway. And um, what I like about it is more of the box because. Um, it's just like look at this like it's an all black box of the Adidas classic and it says the brand with the three stripes and it's got in, in um it's got in four languages um it's got it in English um French um German and Japanese right there Adidas and but over there you got shoe box number two uh, normal uh, classic Adidas, it's just a normal Adidas box. Um, just for, um, for the record, this is not the right shoe box for this shoe. I'm just gonna be revealing it. And this is a recent pair that I got like the um, last weekend. I'm revealing the Air Jordan ones right there. This is um, basically like an it originally was an all white pair, but um, I changed the laces to it because I just didn't like the all white laces, I just like them with like black and mixture right there. So, yeah, so it's got that Nike swoosh right there, the Air Jordan. I like that Air Jordan logo, and this is the high top model. It's like a mid, a mid top version about this, and um, it's got the Jumpman right there, and it is a it is a pretty cool shoe. Not gonna lie, cause um, it's just like it's got like that nice detailing about with like the holes just makes it pretty pretty cool. It makes it like it's not just like an all white shoe. It actually, just reveal a little bit of how the Nike and and reviews it and originally this box was supposed to be a from an indoor um, soccer cleat I sold and I just put it in this box so, just so the Jordans could have a box so over there so we got shoe box number three it's not why do I keep saying shoe box anyway shoes number three we got the uh, it's a gray Nike Air Force One box, a classic Nike Air Force One. And um, I actually like the box of the Air Force Ones because it's just, it's very different from the from the other Nike boxes because some of them are orange and 
and blacks. I like the orange colorway. So we got um the Air Force One, all black. In the this is basically the OG colorways of the the uh, Air Force One. And oh yeah, like I said, or um um originally it had the all white, no the the all black um laces, but I I exchanged that with the Air Jordan ones. So I actually like how they look like with white laces. It's got the um, Air Force back to focus. It's just AF1, and I just like um, mid, this mid top because honestly I don't really like it. They made a high top and a low top variation. Honestly, how it looks like in mid top looks pretty cool. It's just Air, oh no, never mind. Air right there, Nike Air. And I don't think you guys can see good, but it says um um it says. Nike Air Air Force One. You cannot read this honestly, right there, your tongue. And the, what I like about the shoe, it's just that I like that classic all black colorway with the white laces. Actually, looks cool. What I added. You can basically this is basically kind of like a customizable shoe with the white pair. So yeah, this is the Air Force One Air Top Black. So over there, I got shoes number. Four, and this is the last um, shoe I'm gonna bring with this box, and um, and this is the classic orange shoe box. So these, this is not like a sneaker that I would wouldn't normally wear. I would just wear for like one of one if I want to play turf soccer or turf or indoor. Um, so these are the um, what's, what's it called the Superfly Six Academy Six CR Seven. Well, basically AK um, CR Seven. In their cleats, I actually like this colorway. To be honest, it's got like that, like that, like turquoise, um, like colorway. It actually goes good with the with the with the gold. As you guys see, the C4 CR7, and right there, see it's just the C. I actually like how um they made this shoe way better because they actually because you know how Cristiano Ronaldo's from Portugal, they actually put his um the color the color of his flags. In the material, I actually love how they they put more detail in the shoe, and they also put the uh, the middle of the of the flag, the cross, and this shoe is pretty cool, especially the um, the insides, the insole. You guys can see this is um CR7 and Nike. Honestly, I love the CR7 shoe for soccer because these are pretty good for performance, and I wouldn't recommend wearing bring it to like school or, or just normal style because um, due to this really like tight um, collar it actually takes a little longer to put it on just because it's way shorter it's more shorter now that, we, that you can be used to the high top version of these colors so there are the uh, CR7 indoors next we are doing some all red vans right there these these are basically all shoes that, that don't have like box this um just a classic van vans again all red I actually like how they look like because they don't they don't have detail they're just a classic shoe honestly I like how these pretty, look pretty cool because um it's just a all red colorway and oh yeah I laced them up I'm um, pretty loose and yeah, we got some all red vans. Next shoe, we're moving on to Adidas. We got some Adidas classics right here. Honestly, like um this this um brand better than the newer brand of Adidas because this is pretty just it's pretty good, um, pretty cool the the classic Adidas. And this is a uh, um I think this was like a 1980s shoe. I don't know. It's just that this is this is kind of like not that hype it's just a it's a pretty good classic shoe so i see adidas right there the three stripes they're, they're actually classic stripes with the, like i actually like this like little spice on the on the three stripes and it is a i think a mid top yeah it's a mid top and and i like how in all the adidas, adidas shoes they put um right with the three stripes and it's also kind of a classic shoe it's the it has the old school colors white and red and yeah this is pretty um cool these these are these moving on to 
some low top Pumas and so like I said this is just a good simple shoe I don't really like the shoes that much detail just like some classic shoes like these Pumas this is Puma right there this is um basket I think it's for like man for, for like basketball I think but I like how they have these stripes and it's a good Puma shoe with goes good with the uh, with the with the navy blue and this you pretty much could rock the shoe with anything um, and it's a good classic little tops some Pumas so moving on to um, some air another pair of Air Force ones right here and this is um this is not a mid top this is actually a high top they made three variations they made a low top mid top and high top so I have um, a high top I don't have a low tops yet but I actually will get to some low tops so, so you guys know it's got that like navy blue swoosh it's got like also that classic like I don't know some like fading blue and it is pretty cool because this is also Air Force right there. This is the same Nike Air Force One. And what I like about also, um, also like about the shoe is the um, that says Air right there. And this is all a classic shoe. It goes it kind of could go with everything pretty much. Yeah. Um, going into the last pair of shoes, these this basically was my fair my like like uh, first like retro pair I guess you could call it of Jordans and. It's like this it's like extreme colorway. These are basically beaters. Do that. These were, um, I think they were rare. I don't know, but like, um, I cannot find these on like StockX or or Go or I mean, any of these websites. But this is a pretty cool um, colorway. It's got that jump man with the all well, these three. I actually like the, these colors because they're actually pretty colorful. With I think it's orange, green, red, and blue, which represents the jump man. Um, four on um, three sides of these colors, and also on the back it looks pretty cool because it's got um, three colors. It's got a blue, purple, and green, and that red jump man, jump man. And what I like also about the shoes that the the three rings that he actually got, he actually got six rings, and, and both shoes actually have different dates. Like for example, you got a ring ninety one. 92 if you can actually guys read that but there is this thing I don't know you guys can look at it but it says 91 92 93 and um, and the other one he actually says he says 97 and 98 and what I like more about the shoe is the like just look at all those details they have just all those details they have and they put more effort in the shoe and it's pretty ugly from the bottom they're pretty yellow I don't think they're very struggle but we have another shoe box, but I'm gonna tell a little story about that. The this is actually an Air Jordan 3 box. And it was pretty it was a pretty expensive shoe. As you guys know, it is not. Have nothing. And I'm gonna tell you guys why I don't have nothing in this shoe right now. So the reason I don't have it, it was originally an Air Jordan 3, which I'll put in the screen a little bit. It was actually um, an Air Jordan 3 Retro Tinker, and well, I did a dumb decision with the shoes. So I was at school, and my and there's this friend that um that said I like your shoes. I actually like selling them. I was like, nah, I'm good. And he just kept wanting these, this pair, and um he actually wanted to trade me for a pair of Jordan 11s, which were ended up being fake and I got pretty finesse there and the reason I didn't give away the box is just by the fact that this is a pretty good box but it would have been better if I gave the, didn't give the shoes away but what I like what I like about the shoes the insides and and it's just all that red and I still have the uh the Air Jordan 3 Tinker tag and this price actually paid a lot of money for this. I actually worked hard to get this pair of shoes. It was actually um, $250. This came with a receipt from Nike. I saw the receipt from Nike. And yeah, this is a pretty sad story about why I don't have the shoes in the box. But I'll give you guys a little 360 of the shoes that I have.
All right, so here's all the shoes that I have. It's in a big ass mess. All the boxes are like hidden in, in there. But that is all for today, guys. I, ho I hope you guys enjoyed this video and subscribe. Give it a thumbs up. Follow my social medias will be down in the description down below. So peace out, you guys. I'll probably make more videos. I'll try to make more. It's because I've been busy with school. But this is all for today's video. And comment down what video I should make next. And peace out, guys.